So you may have seen my post this morning. Um, last week um, I was uh, invited to go and see Helen, who's Wormback Shepherdess, um, and the Wormback Southdown flock. Um, so I popped along on Friday and they were mid lambing, so we had a good old natter in the lambing shed. Um, putting the world to right, discussing agriculture and the future and, and then we got on to talking about the breed, the South Down breed. Now I've had um, very little contact really with the uh, South Downs but I know that they're a native breed and they're seeing a little bit of a resurgence at the moment. Um, I think probably because they're fairly docile, um, easy to handle, easy lambing, but also, which I think is a major factor, especially in the current climate, is that they can be finished from grass. Um, so they're seeing more young people coming in and uh, taking the breed on, taking it to show, taking them to shows, um, but also um, people using the tups on more commercial flocks, um, which um, they're very pleased about. So Helen very, very kindly um, gave me this lovely, really lovely leg of lamb. So I'm gonna just show you here. Can you see? Really beautiful leg of lamb here. Um, so I'm gonna cook that tonight. And as always, it starts with a roast. So we're gonna start with a roast. I'm gonna roast that down quite simply, just with some rosemary and some garlic. Um, I've then got some potatoes, some carrots, um, and some kale, that all of which came in the veg box. So I'm gonna cook that up as well, and we're gonna have that tonight. Um, so I'm, I'm really, really looking forward to trying this, because I believe the favorite flavor is just totally out of this world, so I'm looking forward to it. Um, and then again, as always, with whatever's left over, I'm gonna try and make as many meals as possible to feed my family. Um, on this top quality joint of lamb. So um, I'll call back again.